to why we need to stop using mouthwash. Nitric oxide is a gas that is produced by the body and plays an important role in managing important functions, including regulating blood pressure, widening blood vessels and fighting infection. Now, some types of mouthwash contain antiseptic ingredients that can kill bacteria. And these antiseptic ingredients can also kill the bacteria that produce nitric oxide in the mouth. And when these bacteria are killed, the production of nitric oxide is reduced. Mouthwash can also decrease saliva production and saliva contains nitric oxide. So when saliva production is decreased, the amount of nitric oxide in the mouth is also decreased. Some ingredients in mouthwash interfere with the nitric oxide pathway. And the nitric oxide pathway is a series of steps that are involved in the production of nitric oxide. And if any of these steps are disrupted, then the production of nitric oxide can be decreased. A study published in the journal Nitric Oxide in 2012 found chlorhexidine mouthwash, a common type of antiseptic mouthwash, can kill bacteria that produces nitric oxide in the mouth. The study found that chlorhexidine mouthwash reduced levels of nitric oxide in the saliva of a study of participants by up to 80%. In another study published uh, in the Journal of Clinical Periodontology in 2013, found that regular use of mouthwash can decrease saliva production. The study found that people who used mouthwash twice daily for 12 weeks had lower levels of saliva production than people who did not use mouthwash. Another study uh, published by the Journal of Arteriosclerosis, Thrombosis and Vascular Biology in 2014 found that some ingredients in mouthwash can interfere with the nitric oxide pathway. The study found that fluoride, a common ingredient in mouthwash, can inhibit the production of nitric oxide by up to 50%. These studies suggest that mouthwash can inhibit the production of nitric oxide However, it's important to note that these studies were conducted on small groups of people and more research really is needed to confirm these findings. So do you use mouthwash every day? Are you going to continue to use mouthwash? Have you noticed a difference when you're using it in your breathing? I'd love to know. Let me know in the comments.